Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we have got a spicy scoop served straight from the Indian Ocean. You know what we are talking about, right? Modi's island escapade to Lakshadweep. Our beloved Prime Minister Narendra Modi recently took a beach stroll, did some snorkeling and shared his exhilarating experience in Lakshadweep. Cue the envy of a million landlocked souls. Look at him, living his best island life. But wait, did someone say this sparked a tropical storm? Hold on to your coconuts, folks. Modi's beach vibes caused quite a ripple in the Maldives. Three officials got a bit too creative with their words calling Modi a clown, a terrorist and even a puppet of Israel. Oh boy! The Maldives government had to hit the pause button and suspend these officials faster than you can say coconut water. And here comes the plot twist. Indian tourists weren't having any of it. Hashtag boycott Maldives started trending and our social media radios cancelled their exotic gateways to Maldives. Fox even started promoting our very own Lakshadev with hashtag Chalo Lakshadev. Because who needs the Maldives when you've got Lakshadev, right? Here comes the Bollywood to the rescue. Our celebrities joined the party. Akshay Kumar, known for his patriotic role, slammed the Maldives official's remarks as hateful and racist. Even our travel agencies suspended Maldives bookings in solidarity. Ouch! Looks like Maldives went from sun-kissed gateway to a social media shade fest in no time. Uh, our company recently has decided that we will not promote and we will not take further bookings of Maldives from India. There are about 3 lakh passengers who fly every year from India to Maldives. So we are letting go of this business as an opportunity. We got a lot of derogatory messages coming from. Now let's talk serious business. The Maldives depends heavily on tourism, especially from India. Reports say Indian tourists make up a significant chunk of their visitors. So what do you think? Is this a storm in a teacup or a potential economic tsunami? The Maldivian government is doing damage control. But will it be enough to keep the island paradise afloat? And there you have it, Fox. Modi's beach adventure turned into a social media storm and the Maldives got caught in the crossfire. What do you think about the whole situation? Drop your thoughts in the comments below, hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe my more spicy updates from around the globe. Until next time, stay beachy.